Hey, good morning, boys and girls, and welcome back to another episode of Advent Stories with HMC Kids. Today is day five. It's Sunday. We are heading to church very soon. I'm finishing up my coffee, finishing up my breakfast, and I'm heading over to the church. But before I got to the church and got too busy, I wanted to make sure that I hopped on here and we took another little bit of time to read our Advent storybook together. Like I said, today is day five. We have made our way all the way to Genesis chapter 11 through 15, and we're going to learn about Abram and God's promise. You know, we learned yesterday about a promise that God made that he would never again flood the earth. Noah taught his sons about God and the world. His sons had sons and grandsons of their own, and one of these grandsons of grandsons was named Abram. God had a special plan for Abram. One day, God told Abram to leave his home. God promised that Abram would have a family that would become a great nation. I will bless you and make your name great so that you will be a blessing. In you, all the families of the earth shall be blessed. But what is a blessing? A blessing is a gift of goodness from God, a part of his plan to bring us closer to him. God promised to bless Abram, and then through Abram, all the families on earth would have that goodness too. That was a big, important promise. Abram tried to believe God's promise. He took his wife and all his possessions and went where God told him to go. But many years passed, and still he and his wife had no children. God knew Abram was afraid, so he spoke to him again. God told Abram to look up and count all the stars shining in the sky. He told Abram that his family would be as many as the numbers of stars in the sky. And Abram stopped feeling afraid and believed God again. Have you ever had to wait a very long time for something? You know, sometimes during this season, it seems like we have to wait forever for Christmas. But you know, we don't have to wait. To, we don't have to worry about whether or not Christmas is coming. And we don't have to worry about whether or not God's going to fulfill his promises. Because God is good. And during Advent, we remember just how good he was. Let's pray. Father God, thank you for your many blessings on us and on all of your children. Help us to remember those that are not um, as fortunate as we are in the Christmas season. and Help us to give us a heart to do something about that. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Have a great day and I'll see you tomorrow for day six.